I'm at the airport flying to Texas to um, see Chris and all of his trucks and we're gonna drive all this stuff to Tennessee. I just landed in Texas. I got Cash and Chris and the adventure begins. Come with me and go be in a world of ocean violation. <laughs> So this is Pops. This was actually Chris's grandpa's truck. I'll didn't tell you the whole story, but um, he has a 77 F-150. And then he is gonna be pulling Red, who actually was just in the in the uh, woods not too long ago. And Chris has done a ton of work on him recently, getting ready for this trip. He runs, he could pull Pops if it comes down to it. And he is a uh, 76 f-150 and i think he's on an 86 frame but i think red's a really good looking truck and then this is tug he is doing the heavy lifting this week chris just got the uh, slides all sucked in he built a crane for his motorcycle to get it up there so we can take it down on the trip if we want to go check some things out so it's a pretty sweet setup actually everything all together well, we're off. I uh, couldn't get Pop started. I mean, I could get him started, but the clutch kept popping. Um, and it turns out I had the parking brake on. So, you know, that's fun. Well, we arrived in Arkansas safe, thankfully. Um, it was some pretty intense driving as far as just a lot of windy, tight corners, um, both having an old truck pulling a big load. So um, that was definitely intense. I was white knuckling it for about an hour and I'm ready for a bath and about six glasses of wine. Um, Chris's rear brake in the F700 went out and the rear fuel tank was doing some hiccups and so we're gonna have to drop the tank and replace that as well. And then we're also going to hot springs um, and crater the diamonds between the truck pieces. Good morning! This is looking right outside the door where we're staying in Arkansas. It's so beautiful and quiet here. I'm being lazy in my jammies and Chris is dressed and actually doing stuff. But I'll definitely edit this video to make it look like I'm doing this stuff and he's being lazy. <laughs> Part of why this adventure is so much fun is because Chris's entire life is on the road. So we get to enjoy basically his entire house fully functioning as well as his motorcycles. We can cruise around. We're on our way to Crater the Diamonds where we are going to find a bunch of diamonds and become super rich. So, so long suckers! <laughs>
What are you doing? I don't know anymore. <laughs> well, the first repair of the trip is underway. Uh, the rear brake seized up, so it's the wheel cylinder that went out. And amazingly enough, the part store down the road, we're in a town of like 300 right now, um, had the part right in stock. So Chris is going to fix it right now and uh, hopefully we'll get it back on the road pretty soon. What is that? Huh? What is that in your hand? Cheater pie. It's a happy interaction <laughs> with cheater pie. <laughs> is a cheater pipe just a pipe that you use all ghetto like? Yeah. <laughs> okay. All ghetto like. <laughs> okay. I had my own pipe so I'm not going to judge.